and I'm using my new camera. So you got the mic, you got the camera body, you've got the lens. So cool. I didn't know I was going to make this video, but I'm going to make it anyway. <laughs> Hi YouTube, welcome to my channel. If you are new, my name is Lavinia. From the title below, I thought I would talk to you guys about my official mental health diagnosis. If you guys are new to my channel and this is the first video you're watching, I am currently suffering with a mental illness and I've had this issue for the last 18 months and I've been hospitalized multiple times because of it but I have my paperwork here um, that shows my admissions diagnosis. Are you ready? Admissions diagnosis October 17th 2019. The patient has major depressive disorder which is the primary diagnosis and then the secondary diagnosis is borderline personality disorder. I didn't know I had borderline personality disorder. I thought I just had depression. So when I was going through all my paperwork, I noticed that there was a second diagnosis and I was completely taken back. Like, what? <laughs> like, I didn't know I had two diagnoses diagnoses. I don't know what the word for that is. Let me, I want to read you guys the definitions for each of my diagnoses. I gotta get my phone. It's five o'clock. <laughs> so major depressive disorder is also known as clinical depression, a mental health disorder characterized by persistently depressed mood or loss of interest in activities causing significant impairment in daily life. Possible causes include a combination of biological, psychological, and social sources of distress. Increasingly, research suggests these factors may be caused by changes in brain function, including altered activity of certain neural circuits in the brain. I, I don't speak that language, but, but it's treatable by medical professional um, it resolves within months of whatever treatment that may be. Um, it requires a medical diagnosis, which is what I have. And there's lab tests and image rarely required. So that is my major depressive disorder. Um, I This is my primary diagnosis, and I've had this for the last 18 months. Um, and then I was recently diagnosed with borderline personality disorder. So for borderline personality disorder, it's commonly known as BPD or emotion dysregulation disorder. It's a mental disorder characterized by unstable moods, behaviors, and relationships. The cause of borderline personality disorder isn't, is not well understood. Diagnosis may be based on the symptoms. Now the symptoms for borderline personality disorder include instability, feelings of worthlessness, insecurity, impulsivity, and impaired social relationships. So people may experience um, antisocial behavior, compulsive behavior, hostility, impulsivity, irritability, risk-taking behaviors, self-destructive behaviors, self-harm, social isolation or lack of restraint, uh, there can be anger, anxiety, um, general discontent, guilt, loneliness, mood swings, sadness, depression, distorted self-image, grandiosity or narcissism, and thoughts of suicide. So that is borderline personality disorder. Those were the symptoms and the medical diagnosis. And I just wanted to share with you guys my official medical diagnosis due to my mental health. Now, I just recently found out that I had borderline personality disorder. I didn't realize I was diagnosed with it. Uh, I was just going through all my hospital paperwork and I found this, you know, medical diagnosis paperwork and I read it and I was like, oh my gosh, there's two diagnoses here. And I asked my parents, I'm like, 
is this true? Like, is this right? And she's like, yeah, it is. It's like, I didn't know that. So, um, you know, it doesn't make me upset that I have borderline personality disorder or major depressive disorder. It is a mental health issue that I am currently trying to work on. Uh, I'm working with um, medical professionals, therapists, psychiatrists, social workers, counselors. I'm working with everyone to help with my mental health and to help me with my major depressive disorder and borderline personality disorder. I'm working on it. Um, I haven't seen much progress, but then again, um, I'm only in the beginning stages of recovery. You know, it'll take time and I need to understand that it'll take time and I need to give myself patience. I need to give myself time to recover. You know, I can't expect it to snap and be, be gone, you know? So even though I want it to be, but that's not gonna happen. So I thought I would share this with you guys. Uh, I know it's a quick video, but you know, I just randomly thought of making a video about my medical diagnosis due to my mental health. So there you have it. <laughs> If you have any questions, uh, you can comment them down below and I'll gladly respond. Uh, give this video a big thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe if you haven't already. I love you guys super so much and I'll see you in the next video.